Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing my November, October, fall favorites. Um, since it is now December, and um, hope you guys enjoy. So let's just start off with the makeup. Okay, so the first thing are these uh, NYX eyeliners. I ordered them off of Hot Look or Hot Look or Oat Look. I'm going to say Hot Look. Um, and I was, I have to say, I was a little disappointed with my order. It took a really long time to get here. And the shipping was kind of really expensive. Um, so I do not think I will be ordering off there again. Um, but I got these NYX eyeliners and I really do like them. I use the brown and the black the most. And the black is black. And the brown is bronze. Good names. The next thing is also from NYX, and it is a blush. And this is NYX Blush in Pinched. Come on, open. Looks like that. And I really like this blush. Um, I never, I mean, I put it away for a while, and then I took it back, and I was like, okay, fine, I'll wear it. Um... And so, this is one of my favorite blushes. I haven't filmed in so long, this like feels awkward. <laughs> okay, the next thing is eyes. And I have the CoverGirl eyeshadow in... What are you in? Champ? Is that it? No, it's a, it just says Champ. But it's just like this champagne. Oh, maybe it meant to say champagne. I don't know. It's just this champagne color. And I use it right here to highlight. But I just recently heard that CoverGirl tests their, tests their um, products on animals. I don't know if that's true, but if it is, I will never ever purchase from CoverGirl again. Because I'm totally against that. But I don't know if it's true. I have to do some more research. But I already have this. I mean, I can't return it. I've opened it. I've used it. So I might as well just use it up. Next is a the Garnier Nutritional Skin Renew Anti-Dark Circle Renewer. Roller. Why did I say renewer? And it just looks like this. And it has this ball on top that has your concealer on it you just roll it under your eyes and then I just like to pat it in and it covers my dark circles perfectly I don't have real okay it's weird I have my dark circles are darker and worse on this eye than they are on this eye is that weird I don't know I think that's kind of weird but um it covers them up no problem so if you're in school college high school whatever this is gonna be your best friend and this is the most exciting one for me at least because um, I've been wanting it for a long, long, long time and I was finally like, okay, fine. I've got to get it. I have to get it. I'm going to get it. I told myself I'm going to get it. And I know it's a little late. Actually, it's a lot late, but in October, I got the Urban Decay Naked Palette. And everyone else in the world has it but me. Or did have it but me so I got it and these are what it, these are the colors and um, I'm still trying to find some looks to go with it um, but basically my favorite ones are half to bake smog toasted sin and I just started using Creep in a new look that I think I really like. So yes, that's very exciting. And I love my Naked palette. The next are nail polishes. And I pretty much switched off. I pretty, uh, I pretty much like switched off between these two nail polishes during the months of October and um, November. And they are Essie Fiji. I'm wondering if I talked about this in a video, because I feel like I did, but I can't be sure. So, um, 
Miss Glamorazzi did a blog post about this and I thought it was the perfect pink I was looking for. You guys know I don't wear pink nail polishes, but now I do. It's a long story. I have to catch you guys up. Um, but now I do and this is like literally the perfect pink ever. And I love how when you put it on, it like it goes on really streaky, but then it it like dries out really clean and nice and it's beautiful color, so I love that. And then I've also been wearing um, OBI oh yeah, My Private Jet, and you guys know that this is my favorite color in the world. And I just found myself reaching for it all the time. Like, I don't know, maybe because it's the falliness of it or something. Um, oh my gosh, it was open. I hope it didn't dry out. You guys know how, like, OPI oh yeah, nail polishes, like, after a while, get really um, gooey. I'm scared that's going to happen to this. Well, then I just buy a new one. <laughs> I love the color too much. But yeah. So these two throughout the month. And I'm probably going to have new favorites for December. Because it's getting into the Christmas colors and stuff. Okay, I guess next is on to food. And there are three things, I think. And the first one is pumpkin. Like pumpkin stuff. Like pumpkin spice lattes, pumpkin donuts, pumpkin scones, pumpkin anything. Like I've just been really liking pumpkin flavored stuff this fall. And I never ever liked it before. But So it's kind of weird that I like it now. But um, I don't know. Every time I go to Starbucks I order a pumpkin spice latte. Every time I go to Dunkin Donuts I order a pumpkin donut. So I don't know. It's just probably one of those things that just like it changes when you grow up. Two other things. This one is Diet Sierra Mist Cranberry Splash. And this is um, Sierra Mist. You guys know what Sierra Mist is. Except it has cranberry in it. And that's why it's like red and has like this fruit stuff there. But um, I don't know. I never, li I never, I hate cranberry juice. But now I'm thinking I like it because I like this. And it has cranberry in it. So I don't know. But it's super good. It's lemon lime soda, but the nutrition bags aren't bad at all. It has zero calorie, zero fat, zero carbs, zero sugar, zero protein. Uh, and it just has 85 milligrams of sodium, which, I mean, whatever. Everything has sodium. So, yeah, I've really been liking these. Um, and it's caffeine-free, so, I mean, it's just an all-win. So, you guys should try this. And then the last thing is um, raspberries like fresh raspberries. Um, I've always liked fruit and raspberries and stuff, but I just like found myself like, they're so good. I found myself buying them a lot and like just eating them plain because I usually put them in smoothies, but I don't know. This time of season it's kind of inappropriate for a smoothie. I don't know. Um, I still make one once in a while, but um, I don't know. I just like eating them plain. They're just so good. Um, and then for random favorites, like TV, TV, I don't really watch a lot of TV, I've kind of been swamped with work and stuff in school, um, I don't really have time for TV, but I did just recently watch Horrible Bosses, and I thought that was really good, it was really funny, so I put that on my favorites, I guess, um, and... Bridesmaids I watched, which I have to say I was disappointed, but I still liked it. It was funny. Um, okay, and then music. I've been obsessed with Jason Derulo lately, and, like, I don't know why. He just has, like, I think he's really talented. Like, he has a good voice, and he makes good songs and stuff, and so I've really been liking him. And We the Kings. Do you guys know who they are? Um, they're a really awesome band. You should go check them out. Um... My favorite songs from them are uh, Say You Like Me, Skyway Avenue, and um, All Again For You. And the one with um, Demi Lovato. What's that called? I can't remember what it's called. But they do a song with Demi Lovato also. So you guys should really go check them out. They're awesome. I guess that's all for the month of October, November, fall. 
this is actually longer than I thought it was going to be, so I better just wrap this up. So if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a comment below and subscribe up top. And also leave requests down below of nail tutorials that you want to see because I've got some in mind, but I want your feedback and like what you guys want to see. So leave requests for nail tutorials or just anything in the bottom bar and subscribe up top. And I'll see you guys later. Bye!